Welcome back to Glam Me Up. Today I'm going to be doing a very exciting review on the Hana Flatiron and also Masiko.com or Masiko, I'm not sure how to say it. I don't even know if I'm saying Hana right. It might be Hannah. I don't know. This is one of the best flat irons that I've ever tried. I'm so excited to show you guys this. This is also a great gift idea if you want to give this to someone or if you want to ask for it for your own Christmas list. This is a very good thing to ask for because it's not too expensive, but it is something that maybe you would want to ask for for Christmas or you could save up and get on your own. But it's an affordable straightener and it's really great quality. So let's go ahead and get into the review and I'm also going to be having a demo as well and I will put that kind of in the video too as well. That way I can show you it in action and how it works and all that kind of stuff. I feel like if I just talk about it, it's not as informative as I actually like show you like it's straightening my hair and everything because you guys know I have very curly hair and it's pretty coarse and it can be hard to straighten and it doesn't really stay straight but this flat iron has totally changed my whole straightening routine and it's made my hair stay straight so much longer. First of all, I want to talk about Masiko.com. Um, I'll put the link for it right here, or not the link, but I'll put it written out for you right here in case I'm saying it wrong so you can see what I'm talking about. But it's a really great website. They have a ton of different brands of professional hair care products. I think they sell brands like the GHD and stuff like that and Chi, but they also have the brand Hana, which I had never heard of before, but it definitely looked like a professional brand. Like, and it had really great reviews. I love the way that their website is set up. You could easily navigate around what you're looking for. It's got like different categories of whatever you're looking for or different brands or whatever or different products and then it also has a section of reviews and that really helped me a lot because I like seeing um, video reviews and stuff but also I want to see reviews of people who like don't do videos and stuff if you know what I mean so it's kind of neat to see just regular old people's um, reviews not that we're not regular old people but I like to see other reviews too from a wide variety of people so before I buy something so they have a huge list of um, reviews and everything on every different product and this straightener had pretty much all good reviews I didn't really see any negative ones at all they had a lot of good ratings on like customer service and stuff and I totally agree with that I think it's a great website and their customer service is awesome so I'm gonna start off by showing you guys what I got in the box because I was just totally blown away about how sweet and nice it was for them to send all these extra things and if you guys have heard anyone talk about Masiko before they always say that they send them a bunch of extra stuff. So this flat iron was sent to me for consideration for review, um, but that does not change my opinion at all. I would not be taking the time to make this video and the demo and everything if I wasn't truly in love with this product and I want to show you guys the best. So I've taken about a month to test this product out so I know that it works really well. Um, I wanted to test it in different situations. I've, I've tested this flat iron in many different ways like with blow drying it before and without and then also curling it and making it waves just everything I've tried it in every different way and I have been completely satisfied with every different way that I've used this flat iron and another thing I wanted to mention is shipping came super fast like after they said it was shipped I think it literally came the next day or if it wasn't the next day it was like the next day right after I got the shipping um, information in my email and everything so it was super fast I'm not sure if they all ship that fast but I know that their customer service is really great and I'm sure if you had any questions or a problem and you contacted them they would get back to you very quickly um, the responses with me were very quick and also if you're just not sure on what type of product to choose I mean you can always ask me or research it but definitely email them and they will get back to you and they will help you choose the right product because I had no idea like which kind I should get, whether if I should get titanium or ceramic or like what type of straightener and which brand to get. And they were very helpful in explaining to me what the differences were and what was the best one for my hair type. So, so definitely send them an email if you have any questions and you're not sure which one to get. But this, the website on the product info page for that um, flat iron or blow dryer, whatever you're looking at, it's very descriptive on what it is. And then they also have like these little... Um, like icons of what type it is. I don't know, you'll have to check it out to see, but every flat iron is marked with different things, like whether it has infrared heat or it's ceramic or titanium. Um, just all of the different um, like specs that you might want to know about it, it just has them right there. So you can just scroll down the list to see which one has which, or you can narrow the results. It's just really easy to navigate around the page and find the best product for you. So I will insert a picture right here of the box when I opened it of what all it had in it. So make sure you go to my blog too. I'll have a bunch of pictures on there and everything of like as I was opening it and all that stuff and pictures of the flat iron and everything. Um, but I'm just going to kind of go through the box with you guys just to show you real quick the stuff that they send with it when you order this. So this is the HANA box and it came in this huge box with a bunch of different goodies in it. It's kind of all mixed up because I've been going into this a lot. 
But one of the first things that you get is this bag right here, which is great for travel. It's like a velvet material. You can pretty much put anything you want in this, like your hair tools and all that kind of stuff. And then you get this little, um, it's really cute. Like everything's packaged so cute. And I think I've seen people's um, stuff come in purple too, but mine came in pink. Um, I'm not sure if it's just what I ordered or what, but. So you open this up, you can put your flat iron in this. It's got like a pocket up here and this will protect it so it doesn't get hot. Like if you're traveling, because I always like flatten my flat iron my hair right before I go somewhere. And I hate like waiting for my straightener to like cool off. So this is really nice for that. And then it came with a little eye mask, which is so cute. I've never used one of these, but I should, probably should. So that's kind of neat. Um, it came with these little bags, which are nice to travel with, like to put your jewelry in or whatever, and they're cute. And then this little bag here. These are really cute, like pink silk bags. Let me dump this out to show you guys. So this came with a little mini hand san sanitizer that's so cute. And then some nail files that say like Masico.com on them. All that kind of stuff. And then there's another white bag. It's just like all these little things. And it's packaged so nicely. I mean, look at all of this foam bubble wrap that it's going to come in. And then some brochures about um, different styling products by HANA. Products and stuff. And that's their professional hair dryer, which I'd like to try too. That looks really nice. And then also you get one of these little mini HANA shine shine shields. This is a really nice product. Like I hear that they put this in a lot of um, boxes, but this is such a great product. It's a shine serum, but it's also like a heat protect. And I love this. Like I've been using this even when I don't use heat on my hair. It just smooths out everything so nicely and it makes your hair so soft. And you'll see I'll use it in the demo as well. And then I'll also use it in my next tutorial that I show you guys with how to curl your hair with this flat iron. And then you also get one of these heat mats, which mine's kind of dirty because I've been using it a lot. But um, this came rolled up with a little bow around it. It was really cute. You'll see in the picture. But it's huge. Like, you could put, like, several tools on this. I had one that I was using before, but it was small, so I couldn't really fit a lot of things on it. But this puts the flat iron right on it like that, and then you can fit, like, if you're curling your hair too on it. It's just really nice, and it keeps it from burning your table, so that's really great. I feel like I'm missing something. They sent so much stuff. Oh, they sent me a little rose. I put it in here to go with the rest of my flower arrangement. That was just thrown in there. That's really cute. Case that the flat iron came in. This is for traveling. I've already used this for traveling over the holidays, and it was really nice. Like, it kept my straightener from, like, getting any product on it that might have been leaking, and it kept it safe in my bag. And you can put it in there when it's hot because it's lined. But as you can see, it just has got a little divider. So one side you can put the cord in and you don't have to wrap it up because that is one way to ruin your straightener is wrapping the cord around it. I know a lot of people do that, but it is very bad. So make sure you just kind of ball it up in there. Or not ball it up, but like fold it up and put it in there. And then you put the straightener in that side. So that's a really nice leather case that it comes with. And then here's the tin box that the straightener came in. And I'll open it up and show you. So it just has another brochure in here. They sent me several of these, and I think this is the product, yeah, this is the product um, manual that it came with, like, about how it works and everything, like, how the plates are, how it's designed, um, how it's good for your hair. It's just really cool. You'll have to um, look at, read it and everything if you get it, but, and then how to curl it with a flat iron, all that kind of stuff. So that's really helpful, like, if you don't watch a lot of videos and you don't know how to curl your hair with a flat iron or anything to just look at that and it's pretty easy um, to go by that. Oh I also forgot to show you this. It also came in there. That's really cute. It's like little roses. I'm not exactly sure what they are. Like they're scented. Maybe they're for the bath or something. But that's really cute. Just little roses like that. I probably have, I mean I have stuff scattered everywhere so I don't even know where everything that came in this is. But make sure you check out the pictures on my blog and I have everything like when I was unboxing it and everything. So of course I did forget to mention some stuff since I had already put everything away, but they sent a hairbrush. It's got like this metal thing on the inside, so it's really great for like blow drying your hair straight. It's got like the bristles and stuff, and it's a really great brush for blow drying your hair. And they also sent extra makeup and stuff, which I was really surprised, but they actually do sell makeup on Masico.com. But they sent an e.l.f. Um, Hypershine lip gloss and then also an e.l.f. eyeliner pen, like a liquid eyeliner pen. So that was really nice of them. It was totally unexpected, but their customer service is great. I'm so thankful for all the stuff that they sent. It was so sweet of them. 
so this is it and it says Hana right here it's slim this is the one inch so it's skinny enough to get at the roots and then it also it's easy to curl with and it also has these little ridges it makes curling a lot easier and it heats up I mean of course the plates heat up and all but this also gets hot too so it makes it nice for curling and then um, it's got the grips right here on the end and then the plates, this is 100% ceramic plates, so there's no titanium or anything. They also have titanium ones on the website, but I got the one in ceramic. Um, this is the heat setting. Let me um, focus this real quick. So I showed this as well in the demo, but it's just, you can put it all the way up to 450 degrees with this dial right here in the load it. And the lowest is 140, but I keep it up on 450 since my hair is pretty coarse. And then the on and off switch, and it's got a light that blinks when it's ready. And it heats up so quickly. Like, this flat iron will heat up literally within, like, 30 seconds. I'm not sure what the exact time is that it's supposed to, but I notice within 30 seconds, like, it's already hot and I can start using it. So that's really nice. And then it's got the swivel cord, which is always nice for when you're curling it and stuff so it doesn't get all tangled up. And the cord for this is so long. Like... I have kind of an awkward situation with when I straighten my hair because it's hard to get to the plug and everything where I do it so it's really nice you can basically use this anywhere around your house with the way with how long this cord is um, I'm not sure on the exact measurement but I will put that um, on my blog post with this all the exact details and everything so now I'm going to go ahead and take you guys into the demo and then I'll just voice over like the rest of the review and everything. That way you can actually see it in action. But I just want to show you my hair too. Um, I'll also have pictures. I'll insert one um, right here and then I'll have more on my blog. But it's just so silky. Like this is the softest that I've ever felt my hair before. And it doesn't look damaged at all. Like whenever I used to straighten my hair it would just look all frayed and I would have flyaways everywhere. I have a few at the top but it's nothing major. Like it really smooths them down great. And then the ends, here I'll show you, the ends look really good as well. Um, I really do need a haircut, like I have a bad split ends, but this, it's not even showing them at all. Like they look fine to me because it really smooths them down nice. And then also that little mini Hana shine shield makes it really nice because it like makes it smooth over your hair so much better. And then it smooths over the ends perfectly and it protects them. It's just like... It's a very thin oil. It's not thick or anything like most serums are. It's very thin and more liquidy, but it's not. It doesn't have water in it or anything. But it's just nice because you put it on your hair and then it will just seal the cuticle and you can go over it and it won't damage your hair. Like I don't have any. Like it doesn't even look like I have split ends, but I did have split ends before I did this. I think it really does keep your hair protected. Like I don't think it's really going to damage it. I mean, of course, heat is going to damage your hair. You are going to get damage after using it for a long time. But I definitely think with having a nice flat iron, it really makes a difference as to how much damage your hair does get. But if you just keep it trimmed and make sure you're always using a heat protectant and everything, then you'll be fine. But if you have um, dry hair like mine where it's curly or it might be dry or something, then don't do it too much. I probably straighten my hair probably well when I do straighten it I keep it for four or five days but I don't do it every single week like it's I wear it curly like every other week and then I straighten it and I've been doing that for like about a month and curling it and all that stuff I've had my hair more straight this month than I have curly because I've been testing this and I haven't had a haircut in a few months and it doesn't even like it's not even that bad at all like it just I think it's really been a lot better on my hair than my old flat iron because my old flat iron I would see a huge difference like I would see a lot of split ends right after I straightened it so this has definitely helped to protect my hair so I've got my straightener on my little mat thing here and I've got it set to 450 degrees that's what it takes to get my hair perfectly straight and I just turned it on so it's not heated up yet it doesn't take long at all probably 30 seconds at the max and the light is still just red but once it starts blinking which will be the next clip um, it tells you that it's done so you know when it's heated up all the way to the full temperature it's blinking like it is right here. So I already applied some of this Hana Shine Shield before I blow dry my hair but I'm just going to apply a little bit more to the ends of my hair just for some extra heat protectant to really make my hair protected and then I'm just clipping it up in sections like I normally do when I straighten it and I'm starting at the bottom and using a comb to comb it through that way it's nice and slick like as it goes through and it doesn't have any knots or tangles. So you can see how easy it is to slide the straightener over the strand of hair. It does not snag or anything. It's very smooth and it only takes one pass to get my hair totally straight. Now I have already um, blow dried my hair before I did this. I try to blow dry it as straight as possible. That's just so I don't have to run it over the strand as much because that will cause more damage. So I find it's a lot easier and it saves a lot of time if I just go ahead and try to blow dry it straight first. 
but if you want to see um, me straightening my hair when it's not blow dried so you can really see how curly it is and like how hard it is to do that, I will link you to my old video straightening with my old iron and you can see I had to go over it two and three times, sometimes even four times to get it totally straight and with this one, um, I have tried it without blow drying and it only took about two times to get it totally straight but still I'd rather only go over it once or twice um, to get the strand totally straight just so I'm not damaging it as much. The design of the straightener is really nice because it's only one inch so you can get it up very close to your roots if you have really curly hair like mine to where it's curly as soon as it comes out of your head. This allows you to get up as close as possible without like burning your ear or anything. You can kind of just fit it right up over top of your ear and you can get in the back of your head really good because it can get close to the roots because nothing drives me more crazy than if my hair is always straight but then the roots in the back might be a little bit wavy or something. I like it to be perfectly straight and this straightener makes straightening so much easier because I can get right up to the roots. The spinning design is also nice because when you're up at the top you can kind of angle it upward so you can really get that volume and then as you can see here around my face I'm kind of curling it inward. I'm not exactly curling my hair, but I'm just turning it inward so it makes it easier and there's not really any kinks or anything with this because of the rounded edges. So you can turn it as much as you want or you can curl your hair with it and you're not going to get a lot of kinks or anything and you can really give yourself that volume right at the roots by curling it under like I'm doing here um, as soon as you go down your hair, like starting up at the roots. So I finally finished straightening, straightening all of it, so I'm just going back over right at the roots around my part just to smooth down any flyaways. And you can also use the Hana Shine Shield up here too. It's not going to make your hair look greasy or anything, but I'm just kind of fixing my part. I want the back to be kind of volumized, so I'm just going to take pieces around the back and then kind of angle it under to kind of give it some more volume. And then I'm taking all the ends and curling the ends under. That way it's not totally pinned straight and it kind of frames my face. If you have layered hair, this is going to look really nice. And then it just kind of gives it more lift around the um, crown and stuff. This is the finished look. It's so sleek and shiny and my hair is so soft. I've never felt my hair this soft before and it's not frizzy or anything. It's not even that damaged at all. Just some leftover split ends from before but I really think that this helps to not damage my hair as much and it looks really sleek and shiny. And this lasted much longer than my hair normally does when it's straight. It lasted probably four or five days and I only had to touch it up after like the fourth day. It stayed totally straight and it didn't get all kinky. So that is it for my Hana Flatiron review. I will have the link below for it where you can buy it and everything. And then make sure you check out the blog post. I'll have all the information listed, how much it was exactly, and then um, some of the product information and all that kind of stuff, and then lots of pictures. So make sure you check that out for more information. I'll also have more of a detailed review and everything on there. And let me know if you've tried this flat iron or if you are interested in it or if you're going to ask for it for Christmas. Definitely let me know. Leave me a video response if you have a review on something from Masiko or if you've tried something from Hana. Definitely let me know. So that's it for today and look out for some more holiday videos and everything. And then check the link below for my nail of the week and all that kind of stuff. And all my links will be listed below. Also, I just filmed this makeup look today. So I'm not sure which video I'll have up first. I think I'll definitely have this review up. So definitely um, make sure to look out for this look. It's like a wintry, snowy look and everything. Um, but I will link it below after this video goes up. Also, I wanted to mention um, my very good friend here on YouTube, her name's Sabrina. She had to start a new channel. I think it's called like Sparkling Beauty 01. I don't know, I always forget numbers, but it's Sparkling Beauty something. It's a really cute username. But she was formerly known as Sabrina Couture, Couture 17. I think it was 17. Um, I will have her um, new channel listed right here and below. She had to start over and it's always hard if you have to like totally start over a channel. So definitely go to subscribe to her if you haven't already. Her um, channel is also listed in my other channels box. So make sure to go and check her out and tell her that I sent you. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye everybody.